Hi, this is James Parkin, the Sales Funnels Engineer, and today I'm going to be looking at how to set up ClickFunnels with a Google Domains account. And this really came about because I noticed a couple of people within the ClickFunnels Facebook group were struggling to get ClickFunnels set up with a domain that they'd created through Google. So I'm just going to go look through the process and hopefully get everything working well. Let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do is purchase a domain through Google. And so to do that, we just search in this bar as most Google things are. Funnels Engineering, this was a domain that I was interested in. Um, one thing I did like about the Google Domains interface is that it does provide kind of alternative options if your first choice isn't available, um, which I thought was pretty interesting. Um, so Funnels Engineering is available, so I'm going to go ahead and add that to my cart. And that's all I'm going to do today. So let's, let's check out. Um, auto is new. I don't like auto renew, so I'm going to turn that off. Privacy protection. Yep, that's always good, as long as they don't charge you extra for it. Excellent. No, no extra cost. It's always a nice feature. Checkout. So I'll go ahead and do this checkout process and um, we'll continue with the ClickFunnels setup. So I purchased the domain and here we are in the Google Domains homepage. So here it is. What I'm going to do actually is copy that um, because the next part is to go over to ClickFunnels and add it as a new domain in my ClickFunnels account. I'm just going to hit the add domain register a new domain I'm going to use an existing domain dub, 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 dub. funnels engineering just copy that in there and click add okay yeah so the next thing we need to do is add the CNAME record um, points dub, 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 to target at clickfunnels.com um, so let's figure out how to do that in Google. And I'm guessing it's going to be under DNS. Okay, what have we got? Custom resources. So we need this to be a C name. target.clickfunnels and then this value here is going to be dub 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 um, we can leave that there's a time to live record basically just tells you how often a record is updated that should be fine so let's try and add that cool Okay, and now let's go back over to ClickFunnels and hit the I've done this step. And let's see what happens. Let's hit check now. Okay, so that's suggesting that it hasn't been updated yet. So what I'm going to do is wait a little, wait a few minutes and see what happens next. So I have waited a couple of minutes and let's check again. Okay, great. So www.funnelsengineering.com is now connected and ready to use. And what I am going to do is actually connect it to this demo funnel, <coughs> which doesn't do a lot at the moment. Um, and so it won't be hurt by associating it with this particular URL. And now let's see if I go to funnelsengineering.com. I'm still being taken to the ClickFunnels dashboard page. So let's just go in and have a look at this funnel quickly. 
Then my funnel. Let's have a look under the settings. Yeah, admittedly, this is not a well set up funnel. So let's, in fact, on the order form, as that actually has something reasonable behind it. We have demo order form. Let's go to this URL here and see if we have a page appear. Okay, so currently it's not HTTPS. We can go through that in a minute. So let's go advanced and proceed. I know what it is. 403 forbidden. Interesting. Okay, let's continue on this spiral. Um, so the first thing we can do is under domains, if I select funnelsengineering.com, let's just briefly try something quickly. No, it's still redirecting me to the secure website. So we can secure it with SSL. We expand and add SSL here. This is all within ClickFunnels. So set up. So initiated. So yeah, it does take 10 to 15 minutes for this to work. So I'm going to stop the video here and come back once that's done. So it's been about 10 minutes since the last um, time I checked this. So let's do an SSL check. Let's see if they have finished updating it. Yes, it is now ready. Funnelsengineering.com. Now ready. So that just means that SSL is enabled for the domain. So now let's go back to the website and see how much further we're getting. So this is a ClickFunnels page set up through Google domain. And the main change in Google was just making sure that the DNS record is dub dub dub, type C name, doesn't really matter about the time to live. Short time's good though. And target.clickfunnels.com. And then ensuring that within ClickFunnels, we're adding the domain through our preferences, domains, and then setting up SSL as well so that the site is secured. And that's it. Let me know if you've got any questions. Thank you for watching.